What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Well, he saw the thumbnail. Yep. Nick got his 75th trailer. This thing is insane. Let me show you. And the buggy, again, a little status stuff that almost done. We had to make some changes here. So, if you guys remember, I had for the crankcase just a little, you know, 90 that came down and ran down right there. Well, the problem with these valve covers, these comp LS covers, is they have no oil cap. See here? So they're solid. So what you do is you use pretty much this. All right, I lost it already. Right here. So this is pretty much my oil cap and my, you know, CCV. So it goes into there. Well, <clears throat> what we're gonna do, instead of it draining the oil on the floor, I'm gonna swap this out. So this is a dash 10. I gotta get a dash 12 because that's, I'm using this little catch can right here. And I'm gonna run a line, a little 45 from here, and it's gonna go into here. So the oil that is splashing, because remember we got oil coming up from the push rods and we got oil squirters in this thing. So there's so much oil being squirted in this thing. When it does squirt up, it's gonna come up and come back down, drain back down and not just drain and you know come out of the ground right there. So this is uh, what we gotta change. I pretty much just need this fitting, but in a dash 12. And we got, you know, customer scan name here that got to get a bunch of stuff done, but stay tuned for that. Let's go check out Nick's 75th trailer. Right now, this, this driveway is, I mean, I got to get a bigger house or bigger driveway. I mean, there's just, we got trailers, trailers, got Escalades, got Rammers, trailers, oh, trailers, trailers. Now, look at this behemoth. It is like a never ending train this is the longest bumper pull i have ever seen what hey. the shit? how you doing in there i think you got a little work, man a little desert sand yeah we just finished this side we're going to this side now. oh my god so what he's doing guys is transferring everything like his bed um you know pots what, whatever like the essentials that he wants transferring everything in there you know he's got his new sheets and everything um but this thing is massive. So, and if you guys are interested, this one is now for sale. This is a FSW28, I think. Let me let me show you here. And the main reason is, well, because he cannot fit the sand car in this one. FSW28 is this one. So, the um, new one is, I think it's an FS3400. And boy, it is, yeah, FS3400. And this thing is massive. I mean, it, it's, I hear, what, what? Oh, he's got the AC on. He's plugged into my 50 amp. Hey, I charge for this, dude. What, what the hell is going on over here? Look at this, guys. Oh, he's got his AC crank in. What, where's the AC? Oh, there, there we go. Why isn't it cold? I have the, just the fan on, not the AC. Why don't you turn the AC on? No, the doors and windows are open. Who cares? This guy, he doesn't even have the AC on you. Dude, there you go. Hi, boom, crank it to 60. Now we got the AC going. Close this. There you go. What, what the shit? So, there we go. now we got the AC. Guys, we're what? detailing each other, we're not cleaning. I was trying to explain the difference between cleaning and detailing. Look at this, ready? I don't know if you can see that, let me see. Nasty, huh? Now look at this side, ready? Wow. What are you doing right now? Why don't you clean the top? Oh, dude, step up. Ready? Wow, step up look on at this. I was looking for my step stool. Ready? Step up on this. All right, guys, look. Step up on this. Whoa. I mean, yeah, you got some flags and kites and no big deal. Oh, that dirt. Now step up on Oh, here. is that dirt? Oh, yeah. I thought Hang it was on. brown. Oh, that's brown, dirt. No, it's not brown? Check this out. I thought it was wood. Just like a wood and. Yeah, uh, wood. Ready? Look at the wood. It's not wood? Oh, I guess it's not wood. Whoa. <laughs> That's insane. What the hell did this guy do? Fucking take this trailer dooning? Holy shit. We gotta put a TV in here, guys. So, this is Nick's new billet. This is the bathroom. Hey, how you doing? This is the bedroom. Hey, how you doing? Did I say that's the bathroom? That's not the bathroom, that's the sink. That's the bathroom. Shower. So what he doesn't like about this, the only flaw he's saying is the other one, has a way bigger shower if you guys remember it's huge like the whole front end of that trailer is a bathroom and shower yeah, where nice. 
Well, the other one's just more, it has bathroom shower. This is more of like... It's got like the nice can light. Yeah, the can light. Like, he doesn't like this lighting. I mean, I think this is more of like a, a storage trailer. I like how these open this way. They're in the way. And this one, like, for example, the shock's broken, so now I gotta see you're holding it. Oh, uh, well, you could just replace the shock, I'm sure. So this one, guys, why I like this one, this was my old layout. You guys remember my old Bing Ding that I had? It was the identical layout to this where the, and why I liked it was because there was still room to pull quads or something up here in the kitchen. So the other layout I'll show you, he, he didn't have this. So he's got 16 or 17 feet of storage right here. And then he's got like 20 or, or what, what is it? 19, 20 and 24 or something. Based. So all the way up here, if you want to come, is 24. And obviously this you know bed folds up like that. So... There, this thing just has a ton, tons of room in it compared to uh, the other one. The other one is for sale. How much are we asking for the other one? 22. 22. And I will show you guys the other one, the difference between, you saw this big behemoth. Oh, there you go. All right, come on over here. And this one is corrugated sides, so it's a little lighter. This one is not corrugated sides. This is just uh, solid sides on it. And let's go show you a little tour, give you a little walk around of uh this one corrugated sides like janky <laughs> oh yeah see look at this so this whole massive thing right here is a bathroom look at this I mean, look, look at the bathroom in this one so this bathroom is huge this one's got a full-blown like real bat and this one what year is this it's 2008 and the other one's a 2007 Seven. yeah so literally one year difference but the bathroom in this is massive look at the bed I mean, you got, you know, you could walk. The other one, he's got no walking. Jump in it. Yeah, you have to jump. So you actually have a bed here. Uh, but, you know, here, here's the downfall is storage. See here? So his storage, he can't really pull anything up right here. It goes pretty much from here. He's only got, I think, what, 13 feet? Yeah. Yeah, so 13 feet, but that's it. So you see, I mean, this thing looks really, really small compared to that one. And that's it. You can't, you, you got the fridge here. You got your chingus there, and you're you're done. You're gonna hit there. If you have a you, razor or can am. This is the trailer you want. Yeah, if you got like a regular razor can am, you can get one of these. I mean, you can pull a quad probably up in here, a little a little fifty it's or quad, something. Yeah. yeah, but that that's the difference, guys. But this trailer is very very clean. Same thing. They're both billet editions. He somehow keeps finding Bluetooth these billet editions. <laughs> Bluetooth, Bluetooth radio. radio. I mean, it's it's it's, it's nice. You know, it's just for us. It's too small. For what we Can't do, we fit. don't need much living. Yeah, we need more riding, more storage. More storage. Yeah, so uh, other than that, guys, that's you know pretty much it for uh, his situation. He did upgrade these lights to the LEDs. It does have, it's got 150 gallons of water, right? Yep. Same as the other one. <clears throat> 150K, or 150, 150K, 150 gallons of water. Uh, he's gotta change these lights still. But other than that, you know, everything everything works. Fridge works, AC works. Um, yeah, oh yeah, he polished, spent a lot of time polishing it, used it twice, and that was it. <laughs> now he's sitting and you should you can see like this whole thing is all polished right here. I mean it's all I don't know if you guys can see that on camera. Let me show you the front where the sun's smacking. Wow, no wonder you like it right here. It's all shaded already and stuff. <laughs> That's why he backed it right here. He's, he tried to he wants to be like halfway in the garage over there. And then what is it? What are you doing here? I extracted it. Oh, extracted, it's cleaning. We're detailing the trailer. See the front. So this is not done, but here's like what the final oh, product is. Oh, it's not done. This side, like after being polished. Oh, there you go. Can you guys see that? If you look at the top where I didn't do anything to oh, it. Oh, damn. Yeah, the top it's is very dull. dull. So this one got wet sanded, three, three cuts, 1,500. Well, 800, 1,500, 2,000, 3,000, four cuts. It's a four cut. This thing is a monster. This well, lots of detail. I know what you guys are gonna ask. How's this whole rammer gonna do right here? Well, he brought it from LA. Yeah, it was empty, but he said it towed beautiful. So, I guess once we're gonna load the buggy, load everything in, and well, stay tuned. We're about to find out. Tow test time. There you go. And also, before you guys ask me update on Nick's car, uh, all we've done pretty much so far is put the motor in, just because we're still waiting on more parts. So. Now he wants a cam and now he wants valve covers. Now he wants all these goodies. So we're, we're lagging on that. But 
That is Nick's new trailer. So obviously the old one's for sale. Uh, he just posted it. I think it's on Off-Road Like Loans and Straight Up Trader and Craigslist. So you guys can go check that thing out. Um, pricing, I don't know. You're going to have to DM Nick. He'll give you all that info on pricing. The best deal. Don't ask me because it's not my trailer. I got no idea what the best deal is going to give you. Also, boys, you know, we might, might do a trip before Halloween with this old girl. Uh, before, like, the whole group goes out. Just in case, I don't think there's any flaws or anything's gonna happen. It ran great, ran good on the dyno, had good numbers, uh, motor strong, you know, so. But I, I just, I might do my own run soon. I've been looking at the weather down at uh, Winter Haven, California. And, um, you know, that's the weather when you look it up, see what is in the desert. And it's looking pretty good. It's not uh, like the high was like 91, 92, so that's not bad. So we do a little morning and evening runs you know and we'll see we'll go from there but that's all i got for you guys so thank you guys for watching this video if you guys like this video hit that thumbs up button don't click subscribe peace yeah